Now let's take a look at the iPhone's Waze app and how we can clear the cache. So there are some things which you can do on the Androids a lot better than on the iPhone. So on the iPhone, we have to do some workarounds. Essentially, you can open up the Waze app like that, find the gear icon and go to the settings. And there is some sort of data which you can manage within the app that can be cleared. For example, inside of the privacy section, you can check out the navigation history and this can be deleted right there. So you can delete it all. And now there is going to be less data attached to the application. But you should know that there isn't any button or option to just click and clear the cache of the application. The option which you can perform is to simply reinstall the app if you feel like it doesn't work that well anymore. So you can hold down on it, click on the delete, and when you remove it and then reinstall it back from the app store, you're going to notice that it is much more uh, fluid and easier to use a lot of times. But yeah, on the iPhones, we do not have the option to just clear cache like you can on the Android. Obviously, you can perform some changes to the app and find some app related settings right here. So you can change the location and everything else. But again, the cache is simply not there on the iPhone. So that's basically it. Most definitely let me know below in the comments if you manage to find some solution or something that you are happy with. Thanks a lot for watching and I'm going to catch you later in the next videos.